Hey, I'm gonna show how to withdraw from your Acorns Later account. So the first thing you'll notice is if you go to the website app, it doesn't let you access Acorns Later. So your Acorns Later is your IRA, and um, it's a tax advantaged account, which leads to some limitations of what you can do with it and withdrawing and blah blah blah. But Acorns kind of tries to prevent you from withdrawing because if you have an Acorns Later account, you pay them one dollar a month to have it. So they want to stop you from opening it. So the first thing you'll want to do is well, open your Acorns app, get your PIN in so you can log in. You might have an ad or something that you want to click away, then it will be loading. Then if it's loading, and uh, you're on your home screen, you'll see in the top left these bars for the menu. So first you click on that and then here it will say invest for your future. I know my camera is a little bit blurry because my laptop is old. Anyway, so you will have to click invest for your future which should be the top menu item. And then you're here. You're at Acorns Core and Acorns Later. So you want to withdraw from Acorns Later and ideally close your Acorns Later account because then you'll be paying one dollar a month less. So you click, you tap on Acorns Later and here you will see the withdraw option. So you just tap withdraw. And now um, it's going to give you a whole bunch of warnings to scare you into not withdrawing. So these warnings are true. However, they're not giving you the full pictures because they want to prevent you from withdrawing. So if you click on continue uh, and you click on early withdrawal, it's going to say that you might have a 10% penalty tax. Now, that penal tax penalty is real. However, what Acorns is not telling you is that 10% is only on your gains. So you're not going to lose 10% of your money. It's if you put 100 bucks in, and now it has 150 bucks in it, so you made a $50 gain in the past year or past few years, then you will have to pay 10% of those 50 bucks. That is extra money anyway already. So I'm gonna click on early withdrawal. Um, again, this will send an estimated 10% for federal taxes. Again, this is only on your gains, so don't worry about it. Then in tiny letters you'll see your balance available. So you want to type in the actual balance available and then tap withdraw. Now I'm not actually going to tap withdraw because I'm not going to withdraw this amount, but I would recommend that unless you have a large amount of money in this IRA, so in acorns later, that you do cancel your Acorns Later account and then you just stick to the Acorns Core, the basic Acorns. So that should be it. To recap, you cannot do it on the website. You have to log into the mobile app, tap on the menu, go to invest for your future, then tap on later, tap on withdraw, continue. 10% tax penalty is only on your gains, not on your basic account. And then you can withdraw the money out of it. Normally, once you have zero dollars in your IRA, so in your Acorns Later account, you should not be paying one dollar a month. If you want to be certain, you can also contact Acorn Support after you withdraw and ask them to close your Acorns Later account. Okay, that was it.